Good afternoon, Scarview 237, Casa Fernandez, Norse Leaf, Robusto. Nice little box press cigar. It's really funny when you read stuff on Scar International on some websites, they don't mention this box press, but it is, although pretty lightly, kind of more so on the end than in the middle. Um, 5.25 inches, 50 ring gauge, Nicaraguan made. Draw as well. Birds. Pretty evenly, not perfectly, but pretty evenly. Uh, I do get notes of cedar. A lot of times, you know, I love Cigar International. I order from them. I think they do a good job. I will say that their their reviews often are just uh, garbage. But this time I agree. I do get a lot of cedar. I mean, just a lot. A massive amount of cedar. I do also get some light coriander. Grass. And maybe a tiny hint of milk, milk chocolate. And it's funny, if I was to go back through my last... 237 reviews or I think chocolate and probably maybe I don't know cedar those are the predominant notes that I get which you know to me that's what cigars taste like and maybe it's just because I love chocolate but those are kind of the notes I get the cedar the coriander the grass which is nice it's, it's funny sometimes you know when you're not dealing with like the Canadella type cigars you don't get that oftentimes in Connecticut cigars some of those kind of earthy notes will pop up but it was nice I do think it's funny in the advertising that they said, this isn't your father's Connecticut. What does that even mean? I mean, really, I would like someone, a manufacturer that used that phrase, I would love for them to explain to me the difference between your father's Connecticut and this one. Does it have more flavor? Are the flavors different? You know, hey, if, if there's someone that watches my reviews that, you know, is, is 50 or 60, I would like an explanation of how they changed over time. I did some Googling and I couldn't find a thing. Uh, anyways, guys, that's Scar Review 237, and I'm actually going to go with a, um, I'll go with a soft buy rating on this. I don't think it's phenomenal, but I don't think it's bad either. As always, thank you for watching.